Hey, I thought I'd show my uh, build for Wang Yi since I've had some people ask and it's a new weapon. There's not a whole lot of information about it so I figured I'd show what I'm using. I went ahead and went with a full slash build. Now, normally I put void gems here and then one of the gems I put with my uh, I replaced with my hex edited combo gem which has the, the witch time and stuff on it. So if you're curious what the uh, the witch time gem is, uh, this is all that I put on. I didn't put anything too broken. I just put the drop rate on there for the lore gems and stuff, but now that we can craft them, that's kind of useless too, so I might put something else in that slot. Uh, apparently you can have up to six abilities on a gem, even though in the game the, the max is four, so maybe they're planning to expand that later on. And anyway, uh, you can see what I have here. So I've got a pretty well-rounded build here. Uh, what I will probably do is spec in flow attack since it's your flow attacks is where all the command grabs come from and those are what do a lot of damage uh, for now I'm running with this uh, I've got 58% attack 29% attack speed and then a total of uh, 37 actually 37% uh, attack speed so I have flow attack plus 68% which is actually not bad could probably get a little more but I just haven't felt like resetting or using cheat engine to get anything better. You can see I made uh, quite a few here. But I think attack speed is also important with her because a lot of her good stuff is at the end of the strings. So basically everything has attack speed or attack up or uh, flow attack up. I do have a bunch of May drops in here. If you watch Grow870, he gets uh, a metric ass ton of those. It's, it's always hilarious to watch him uh, try to get good gems. But I probably need to optimize this a little more. Uh, otherwise, I might just go into the Void Gem builds. I think I do have a couple good flow attack ones in here somewhere. So right now, I'm going to go test, uh, see if... She works well with high attack speed. Like, I think Zushu, I think with his new sword and hook weapon, I think, like, if you stack too much attack speed, that might be what's causing uh, some of the stuff to just not work properly, but I haven't really heard back from too many other people, so if you know anything about that, if you want to help me do some testing, go ahead and let me know in the comments. So let me uh, go to my hideout here. I will also do a, uh, a true new Heifei Castle video with uh, Zhang Hei because I have not done him yet. But I kind of want to see what build actually works well with him. I think Flow Attack and Slash would probably be a, an optimal build for him because he has such long strings. Yeah, they get decimated pretty quickly with uh, Slash on. So I'll go ahead and I'll show uh, probably what I'll do with Zhang He really quick. So 
since he has not he has not received a uh, true new Hefei Castle video yet. That's a shame that like every single thing they do with this game, it, it just backfires. Like just people hate everything. <laughs> I think. You know, it is true that these weapons should have been in the base game, but they actually do play pretty differently from, you know, the, the standard, you know, flow attack template that this game has, where a lot of the weapons do combo very similarly. And I think it's a good foundation for them to, uh, you know, both declone the other characters and, you know, kind of expand on what's actually possible with this new combat system, including, like, adding the gimmicks back and stuff. No, I think those things are excellent. It's just, it's a shame that people uh, just don't like anything they do with this game anymore. <laughs> All right, so I want to roll. Uh, I want to spec in slash and flow attack, if possible, and attack speed, of course. He kind of plays like an old school charge attack, like Dynasty Warriors character, and that a lot of his good stuff is at the end. So, a lot of people say that you know, some people say that uh, you know, attack speed is all style, no substance, and it's not necessary. It actually is kind of necessary with this character because otherwise, it's going to take forever to to get to anything that's uh, actually useful. So I would probably have to go. Uh, fire up the crafting thing and make some better stuff with him unfortunately I don't think I have anything too great flow attack is a must with him from what little I played as him alright so there's one I can't blame anybody for using a cheat engine to get these gems because the the RNG is just, it's like out of control. You can't get anything you actually want pretty much. It's it's always going to be like really random. You can see a lot of these are like really good, but then they have a bunch of junk on them like the major ops. I wish the major ops were uh not in the game or they weren't so uh frequent. Alright, here we go. Flow attack plus 13%. If I can get him to like 100%, I think that would be a pretty good baseline for him. Ideally, I'd like a little more attack speed as well. I can probably go without it and then just go... Uh, just go with avoid gems, have a half-half build. Ah, it's only 3%. That's garbage. Ah, this should work. Alright. Now I need to make up for the uh, attack speed deficit. Ah, oh, here we go. Try to get him to 100% flow attack and then maybe get a little bit of an attack speed or uh, attack up bonus as well. Since, like I said, I think attack speed is going to be really important on him. Ah, here we go. Alright, so I've got one more slot.
Probably go with this one. I got two May drops in there, but that's good enough for now. 105% flow attack should work really well with him. Alright, let's take him out to the field really quick. bad. I think not having a attack up is kind of hurting him a little bit with his current build. I'll have to optimize this further. I'll try to get on one more bandit. Yeah, so you can see why uh, flow attack is going to be really good on him because his strings are like way longer than anyone else's. At least from what I played, I, I have experienced most of the move sets in this game by now, so I think uh, might be able to forego a little bit of attack speed and probably just spec it like flow attack and attack up and have a little bit of attack speed sprinkled in there if you can. So I'm gonna take some time. Uh, maybe I'll cheat engine brute force the RNG and try to get some more gems <laughs> would be a little more suited for him so uh, it'll probably be a little while before I get around to doing his true new Heifei castle video I'd like to find something optimal that works for him and he's kind of a little harder to spec in because he, he really needs flow attack kind of like Zhou Tai you don't want to bother specking in uh, flow attack with him because it's his stun trigger is what's really broken about him Whereas with this character, he's, his triggers are really nothing special. It's mostly the flow attack strings are what makes him unique. So I'll have to uh, I'll fire up Cheat Engine or something and try to get those gems later on. I'll try to do it by this weekend, maybe. Anyway, I hope this helps you guys, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace.